Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this short video, we are going to have some discussion about MCQs of pile and porifera or sponges. Let's move to the question number one. It's about dividing cells remained together and changed into a multinucleate mass. It's a description of hypothesis describing multicellularity and it states colonial hypothesis when cells remain together in the colonial form and then this mass developed later into a two-layered ancestor or a multicellular organism that's called colonial hypothesis while syncytial hypothesis states that a multinucleate mass developed first just due to schizo just like the pattern of schizogony or multiple fission and that multinucleate mass later on developed cell membranes around it and developed into a multicellular organism while endosymbiosis and membrane invagination hypothesis they describe the evolution of eukaryotes from prokaryotes one of the following characters never found in sponges sponges are asymmetrical they are having diploblastic organization and sorry sponges are asymmetrical or sometimes radially symmetrical and they are having blastular stage that's why they are included in the animals but they're never uh, never included in diploblastic organisms because cells are not organized into proper layers in case of sponges they may be asymmetrical they may be radially symmetrical but diploblastic organization is not their feature number three we can find all of the following types of structures in mesohyl or middle of the sponges except mesohyl of the sponges contains spicules amoeboid cells as well as spongin fibers but nidocytes they are the characteristic features of cnidarians not sponges that's why right option over here is delta. Microvilli of the coronocytes in sponges are connected by the help of microfilaments and they are the characteristic feature of collar cells or coronocytes. Euplectella, venous flower basket, belongs to, it belongs to class hexatinellida and uh, hexatinellida is having 450 to 900 meter uh, that location and euplectella is the common representative member of the of this class the cells which move about in the mesohyl and are specialized for reproduction secreting skeletal elements transporting and storing food they are known as amoeboid cells so right option is beta amoeboid cells are found in the mesohyl and they are responsible for secretion of skeletal elements they are responsible for reproduction as well as transportation and storage of food. Number seven, porocytes and sponges are modified forms of pinacocytes or outer cells. It's a porocyte you can see over here. And porocyte, they are modified forms of pinacocytes. Least common form of sponges out of three oscon, sicon, and leucon is ascon. And ascon sponges, they are the simplest as well. So, right option is alpha. Which of the following sponges do not possess a well defined spongocele? Sponges which are having highest level of body wall enfolding, they are uh, having, they are usually found without spongocele or body cavity. So, leucon body form is the answer because they are having highest folding in folding of body wall and they do not possess a spongocele which is observed in case of a scone and sicon type of sponges number 10 the representative of class calcarea is leucocelenia leucocelenia having erect tubules they are the representative member of class calcarea with grantia <coughs> or scypha Number 11, major nitrogenous waste product in sponges, they are aquatic and they are having the simplest organization as well as simplest waste product that is ammonia. So alpha is the right option. Most of the sponges, they are filter feeders, but few are carnivorous as well. So right option in this case is Charlie. Number 13, water circulation is maximum in sponges just before sunset. So, right option is Charlie. Self-fertilization sponges is avoided because 
Sponges, they produce their gametes at different times and they are monoecious. But still they produce their gametes at different times. Usually they are having protendrous condition. That is, uh, they produce male gametes first. So right option is Charlie over here. Sponges sperms are captured by quinocytes during fertilization. So alpha is the right option. Early development of sponges, it occurs in the mesohyle of the body cavity and later on they settle down into a larva form which attaches the bottom to the other surfaces as well. But early developmental stages, they are completed in the mesohyle. Resistant capsules containing masses of amoeboid cells in sponges which are formed during asexual reproduction, they are called gemmules. Highest power of regeneration among following is found in sponges. Leucoselenia is a S -con, an S-con type of sponge. So right option is alpha, it's an image from Hickman zoology. Esconoid, leucoselenia, psychonoid, psychon, and leuconoid, u spongila, u spongia. So right option over here is alpha spicules they are secreted by some specialized cells known as sclerocytes as you can see there are different types of cells in the mesohyle sclerocytes which are responsible for the secretion of spicules spongocytes they secrete spongin fibers cholinocytes secrete fibrillar collagen and lophocytes they secrete large quantities of collagen but are distinguishable morphologically from cholinocytes so right option over here is alpha that was all about sponges our next discussion topic will be about cnidarians thank you so much thank you for watching